Hello everybody, Calibus here, back with more Hearthstone. Today is the day we are having our Brother on Brother Bashing Tournament Championship. It is between me and my older brother, Jason, aka Jay Sinister. Right now we are both undefeated in the tournament and it's a winner take all best of three challenge. So we're going to go ahead and get it started. Go ahead and say hi to the people, Jason, and then challenge when you're ready. Alright, the first decks are chosen and the championship begins. Mage versus the Hunter. I'm going to just keep the cards that I started out with because I don't think I need to switch them out to beat Jason. You should coin and fire blast me for your first turn. That's a good start. Oh. A mana worm. And a coin. So right here, I could either unleash the hounds and throw up a Timberwolf, or else I could throw up the Freezing Trap. And I think I want to do the Freezing Trap. See if he makes some more, more minions before I do unleash the hounds. Nice combo there. I'm going to have to find a way to deal with it. What to do? What to do? Bad man of worm. It had to be something. Give me a quest. Who let the dogs out? Alright, so cleared his board. I didn't play my other wolf because the extra damage wasn't necessary. See if he tries clearing any of my stuff or if he plays another creature. I got my eagle horn bow or maybe animal companion for my next turn. Oh, Frost, nobody wants to freeze my people in place. Those are chili dogs. Get it? Chili dogs? Because they're frozen in a dog. Oh, so funny. So I specifically play the Animal Companion instead of the bow because I don't have no traps and because I wanted to see if I could buff up my uh, dogs before he gets it to maybe flame strike range or something like that. So my next turn, I could play Timberwolves, my bow, and I can unleash the hounds again if he puts a couple people on the board. All right, so he got a couple people. All right, a couple arcade missiles flying everywhere. We'll see what gets hit. 
All right, so I took out some of my stuff. Oh, I got some Leroy up in here. That's gonna actually combo well with Unleash the Hounds. So we're gonna actually... Do we Leroy right now? Or do we wait one more turn? I think we save that combo for one more turn. We'll use our bow to take out one of his cabal. We'll take a dog to take out another one. And we'll shoot him in the face. Do you have a secret you're gonna play next? Uh, no secrets in my deck. Yet. I mean, I have secrets, but not in my hand. No secrets. So this turn is going to be a troublesome turn for him, maybe. Especially if he loads up the board with minions. Because I'm going to be able to Leroy. Oh, I'm going to kill that. So I'm going to Leroy. Leroy, Leroy, unleash the hounds and dog. Woof. How much damage is that? That's going to be six. And there's going to be four. So that's going to be eight, nine, ten, eleven. I don't think it's enough yet. I don't think it's enough yet. Do I want to do it? He only has one card, so you know what? We're going to risk it. Take out the mana one. Getting down to the last turn. See if he has a flame strike. Oh. Guess he doesn't have a flame strike because he's killing my minion. Alright. Might be a King Crush victory here. Set it up for turn 9 King Crush. I don't think he's going to be able to kill me with just the two cards. That's not going to save him from King Crush. Alright, so we're just going to peck him down. Shoot him in the face. Throw up more minions for him to worry about these and deal with them. And King, King Crush will get the kill shot on the next turn if uh, he doesn't throw up a ton or something. Uh oh, Jason, getting down to your last turns. You gotta make a good play here. I didn't really help. Doesn't look like you're gonna. He's gonna take the first one. It looks like he's going down in the first match. Yes, but which one of my animals is going to kill you? I'll give you a hint. I have a crush on you. Ah, King Crush. Get eaten by a dinosaur. Alright everybody, the first victory goes down to me. Jason's mage deck is eliminated. I have to play again with my hunter deck and Jason gets to choose another one. So I will choose my hunter. And we'll see what Jason chooses to face it.
I believe Jason has a Warlock deck and a Rogue deck to choose from. So we'll see. I believe his Rogue deck is more controly and his Warlock is more Rush. So it looks like he's going to want to try to out-minion me, rush me down quicker. So we'll see what happens. So I got King Crush starting out in my hand. I'm going to just toss him back. We hope we, he'll come back later for the kill shot, but we're going to get rid of him. We'll keep all the other cards. Looks like it's going to be a trap, trap, trap fest here. So this deck is a, it's a beast synergy trap deck. It's not a typical rush down beast uh, hunter deck that you see in the ranking ladder matches. My rush deck is actually my rogue deck, so I don't have a hunter deck set up for rush really. Man, look at these combos. Alright. And there's the sucky bus. There's a sucky bus. So we're gonna play a trap this turn, and the first trap we're gonna play, you wanna do the snake trap kind of in conjunction with the starving buzzards. And the explosive trap isn't gonna kill him. So we're gonna misdirect and have him hit itself or maybe a minion that he plays. So he's tapping himself. And he is, wow, so fiery. He really wants to rush me down fast. He just lost his, whoa, double soul fire. And that's, that's a little crazy. He's getting a little crazy there, double soul firing. Yeah. So I got to play. Minion that's gonna try to kill that sucker bus so it doesn't keep damaging me too much. So got me down to 18 already. Pretty low. Is he not doing anything? Nothing else that turn? Alright. I think we're gonna do a starving buzzard. Put up the snake trap. He might he might mortal coil that. Which would suck. But I still have a starving buzzard and at least the hound combo to draw cards if he deals with my Oh, so there's a mortal coil, so that's less than ideal for me, but we're okay still. Alright, let's put up a hyena and shoot him in the face. I'm still holding on to my coin, which means King Crush could come out to turn 8 if I get him down to 8 life or less by then. Oh, there's a Hellfire. Just to get rid of a Hyena, I'm not... I mean... Okay. I'm going to... I guess I'm just going to put up the Explosive Trap and shoot him again. There's an Inferno. Definitely gonna have to put out the Freezing Trap. And because I'm thinking about coining next turn, I think maybe I just do this now? 
get a car draw with the Unleash the Hounds. Get an Animal Companion. And turn. Doing two more damage to me. Killing himself a little bit. Give himself a toss. What? No, I'm cool. I'm good. Alright, so freeze it. Alright, so not gonna king crush. Going to instead two, six, seven. play all our other cards. Do an animal companion. Give ourselves a little taunt. Ooh. Do uh Huh. We're gonna hold on to that one. Let's kill command that. Let's hit him. Hit him. Shoot him. And end turn. We'll Alright, we might have them. We have a top protecting us. We might Lord Jaraxxus here. Oh, no. Let's go to Siphon Soul. Kills my taunt. Gives himself a little health. Gives himself a fell guard. And we got some bestial wrath. So. Hmm. This is, I mean, I could King Crush here. I'm very talkative on this one. Oh, I'm talking to the people. I'm just not pushing the button so you can't hear me. But I'm letting the people know that I'm not sure what to do here. Try the crush? Why not? Let's crush him. Let's go for it. We're going all out. Let's kill him with the crush. Alright, so if he could do 12 damage, he's going to beat me. That's not going to save him. Um, that won't... That... He's... I don't... I think he's out of it. Is he? I mean... Well, am I going to be able to do 10 damage? Uh, I finally get my snake trap to go off. I've been waiting all game for that snake trap to go off. Alright. So, we got him now. That's the game. Let's get some draw cards. Well, the the snakes come out, and because they're considered being summoned, it allows me, my allows my buzzer to draw cards for each snake that's summoned. Because the buzzer allows you to draw cards anytime a beast comes out for you. All right, so here's this. We'll just kill the taunt right now. Give him a buzzard. A little buff. Shoot him in the face. We're not even gonna use a snake. Let's use a dog. And I'll kill you with the buzzard. I was worried for a second there, but at least you killed Crush before I went down. Oh, 
All right, everybody. Unfortunately, Jason is down to his last deck. Of course, I do believe his rogue deck is his best, so he's been saving his best for last. But to win the championship, he's going to have to take that rogue deck and beat all three of mine. So we're going to go ahead, load up that rogue deck versus my hunter, and we'll see if he could make an epic comeback to win, or is he going to go out 0-3? Alright, I will just just hold on to my cards, I guess. Just nice low costing cards, not too expensive. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. There's King Crush. It's a little early for me to have him, but hey, join the party. He'll sit in my hand for a while. Loot Hoarder. Not sure if that's worth sending out my explosive trap just yet. So instead, I'm just going to shoot him in the face. See if he throws a little bit more low-cost creatures on the board before I explosive trap him. I was hoping he would, like, coin the device. Yeah, like this one. Now you're just getting silly. Alright. Um, Probably the hardest hitting looter hoarder ever. How the heck was he able to hit me so hard with that treasure chest in his hand? It's, it's like he took the edge of the treasure chest and like smacked me with it. Alright, so he's gonna lose all those people to my trap. Still trying to burn me down it looks like, but he's gonna lose his people. Set off the trap, blow himself up. There you go, take that. Uh, multi-shot, not that helpful here. I think I'm just gonna have to shoot him. And... Damn, you're trapped. We'll see if he decides to keep going for my face as he's being so aggressive, or if he's gonna go for my golden hyena. I had to do something to stop those little guys. Alright, so there's a backstab. And... An eviscerate. Alright, so got me down to 15. He's probably just gonna poke me in the face with this really one dagger. Or, no, he's gonna hold on to it. Alright, so. Don't really got many options here. I'm just trying to hold on. He's burning me down. Alright, there's Drake. I think I have to kill command that Drake, so we're gonna throw out another trap, throw out the wolf, kill command the Drake, Job's done. and enter. Brings out another Drake. And is he gonna poke my wolf? Is he gonna poke my face? Is he gonna do nothing? He's going to backstab my wolf. Alright. Got an eagle horn bow. Shoot him in the face. Hit him in the face, and turn. So the misdirect, if he tries hitting me, is gonna, he'll hit himself 
So that helps out a little bit. Let's see what Alright, loot hoarder, he might run into his loot hoarder now. Alright, got an eviscerate. Not out of this yet. Blade Fury. Alright, still not out. See what he hits. He's gonna hit his rogue. Alright. Alright, so we got an explosive shot. We gotta use that. We don't have no choice at this point. Have to hit him. Nothing I could do but shoot him. And he's actually in range of my King Crush. So if he doesn't kill me here, heal himself, or put up a taunt, King Crush could grab back a win from the Jaws of Defeat. We'll see if he has the ability to do 6 damage. See what he got. And he's drawing cards. He's drawing cards, and he's not going to have something he could play for one mana, I think. I think he's getting crushed for the victory. Wow. GG. It's unfortunate, but when you hold on to a dinosaur this long, you have to play him. Make an appearance in all three games. Getting the kill shot twice. King Crush for the victory. And the rogue goes boom. So, how do you feel about the tournament, Jason? Didn't get the draws that you needed? Nah, uh, just a couple turns late. A little too little, a little too late. Yeah, I was like, I'm going to have him with King Crush unless he does something. Then I seen a sprint come out. I'm like, oh, well, those cards might help if he had more mana to use them. But he was out of mana, so that's how it goes sometimes. So that is it for the Brother Bashy Tournament. Calibus is the grand champion supreme. I now get to keep the 10 foot statue. I'll find a way to get it into my bedroom somehow. I might like just like have my window taken out or something, have it shoved in or something, maybe break it down into pieces, melt it down. It's all made out of gold and shiny. So I could just like maybe melt it and have like a swimming pool of gold in my bedroom or something like that. But uh, I like to thank everybody for watching. My name has been Calibus. This has been the Brother Bashing Hearthstone Tournament. This has been the finale, and I am the winner. Yes, I'm not gloating too much, only a little bit. Everybody, thanks for watching, and we will catch you next time.